What's going on guys, Dog 45 here. So, I'm gonna show you something that was, I don't know, I mean, I guess it would be something special I made specifically for a reason. Maybe that's why it's, it is what it is, but. Hmm, a little messy. Oh, there it is. All right, so this is a dresser. I made for my son before he was born and I made it specifically because we didn't have <clears throat> we didn't have a changing table for him or anything like that and I wanted to have some storage you know as well so it's got you know changing table on the top obviously where you can store his his diapers and you know you can keep all his baby stuff the reason another reason why I made it is because I wanted it to be exactly what I wanted it to be I didn't want it to have to try to purchase something to match my criteria of things I needed so I wanted to have you know drawers on top that I could put things in or more or less she wanted that um and i wanted to have the drawers be able to fully extend <clears throat> so you didn't have to be digging you know in the back or anything you know you had full accessibility to the entire drawer from you know pulling it completely out and all the drawers are like that <clears throat> they all pull out completely you see that it's a full extension other reason i made it this crib was we already had so i wanted to try to get it as close as i could and have kind of the same look as this crib here so that was another we also had just did um some install of hardwood floors in the kitchen so i had a whole bundle of hardwood flooring material left over which was you know which was great it was all red oak um i wanted an oak dresser so majority of this dresser here all the fa all the faces are made from that hardwood flooring material i just joined a lot of it together and plain pieces down and got them to the you know the size that i so here's a little closer look, I mean, on some of the detail portions of it I did, you know, this was, you know, two separate pieces of hardwood flooring joined together. I ripped all these on a table saw. I know I could have bought in a router table and whatever. I just, I cut all this on a table saw and then joined these face pieces together and then put this piece on the back side and glued it in <clears throat> and this is I mean I don't know if you've built furniture or cabinet very similar to a cabinet in a way um, you know these are all inset so they're they're flush with the face you know they're not sticking out they're all they're all flush all of this <clears throat> I mean, I, it took me probably three months total, but that was week, you know, weekends to build this, stain it, spray it. You know, this is all oak. All this is all oak. <clears throat> and then I sprayed it with lacquer. Here's kind of an idea of what the top looks like so it's a a red mahogany combination stain I did a, a bunch of full extension drawers deep you know insides stained it's you know it's all lacquered on the inside as well so maybe um, 
I don't know. To me, it's a special piece of furniture I've made. You know, maybe that's why I consider it to be the best piece of furniture I've ever made. Uh, so if you guys like it, uh, hit the subscribe button. <clears throat> I'll be having some more uh, parts I got for the truck. So I'll be having some more install videos for those pretty soon. All right. You guys have a good one.